What's up you guys, Robert here again for another Tovar Guitar video lesson. A few weeks ago we got a comment as a request to do a song called The Thespian by Alessana. I guess there's not a lot of lessons out there. So we're going to cover that today. This is kind of a long song so let's get started. Um, the first thing you got to know is that it's detuned a little bit to drop D. So your low E string should be in drop D. Okay, the first riff goes like this. So you start with the D power chord. Like that. And then you're going to do this octave trick, which is you, you get the F here on the 8th fret 5th string and then you also get it uh, with your ring finger on the 3rd string 10th fret and then you basically use your index to mute as many of the strings as you can and, and you're just gonna hit those strings So, first it's on D, the next one is on an A chord, but you're going to be doing this thing here on the 7th fret. Just borrow the three lower strings. And then you're going to be doing kind of where you left off with the octaves. 10th fret with your index, and then with your ring finger on the 12th fret on the 3rd string. going to be a, a flat, like that. and then the octave thing is going to go from the 12th fret to the 13th like that index on the 12th to 13th ring finger from the 14th to 15th and the last one is going to be a C power chord your index here on the uh, 10th fret and then you're going to go backwards now with this move so from the 13th and the 15th, go back one, and then go back a whole step. You're basically going back all the notes that you previously had. I said so. 13, 12, Show you the chords to it as well when it does this whole. I'll show you the chords first. So it's a, a D power chord. You can get it wherever you want. Here, here, or open. Fret. 10, 9, then go on the 4th string, 12, 10, 
that goes into the chorus. The chords, it's basically all power chords. Starts on the F power chord. All you need to do is, is uh, get these three strings here on the third fret. Eight counts. Then you go to a D power chord. Then you go to B flat. And to a C. That's it, that's the whole chorus. Then after that, then it goes into the part where the screaming comes in. Uh, you gotta get the open D power chord, which is just a open six, fifth, and fourth string. With that rhythm. Then it speeds up. You're gonna get your uh, your index finger here on the sixth string, eighth fret, three times, and then fifth string, eighth fret, three times. And then go back a half a step and do the same thing on the same two strings on the seventh fret. Again. Okay, so after the screaming part, it just does some repetitions with some of the other parts that you already know. Uh, that part, and then the, it does another chorus, and then after one chorus, it does a guitar solo. D minor, I'm, I'm here using this D minor shape over here on, on, on the 10th uh, position. Slides up to the 10th fret of the, of the G string, then with your pinky, 13th fret of the B string, then 10th fret. So after 
into the more calm part of the song. Uh, there's not a whole much there, but you can get away with playing this. Uh, a D power chord. sound real technical and at times they can be uh, but this one's not as bad as it sounds um, anyways uh, that'll do it for this video if you like what you saw click subscribe if you want me to do any video like you've seen in my channel if you haven't been to it check it out I do like every style every genre um, a click hard to a like oh yeah click like and comments comment and if you like it, if you know any guitar players out there, then uh, share it, spam it on their wall or whatever. Facebook. Yeah, that brings me to Facebook. Uh, like our page, thetovarguitar.com on uh, the Tovar Guitar on Facebook. Facebook.com slash thetovarguitar. And just keep following up with us. Anyways, till next time, you guys. Later. <laughs>